Hello guys, welcome to part one of the final episode of Fivelcraft before I begin the let's play. Uh, this uh, episode we're focusing on mobs. So let's get right in. I've got the new world, uh, mobs world. As, yeah, yeah all, the, all the ones we downloaded last time, like YouTube and everything. Well, we didn't download that, but all the ones I deleted them. So we'll just wait for it. Turn off fly mode, as you can see, Minecraft texture again. So this is the first uh, animal. It is a brown ray. Now they all seem to have disappeared. Except for this uh, This one that just died. So I'll grab, look at those prayers. Grab a spawner. Uh, throw some in the water. And I'll just spawn another one here. Just so you can see it a bit better. It's a brown way. Brown ray. Looks uh, really re really realistic. Really cool. So anyway, that was the brown ray. Animal number one, everyone. Second uh, one is the yellow rays. And these seem to have not died. So as you can see, they're just uh, swimming around there. Good view of one there. Um, still, the spawn egg looks like yellow ray spawner. So yeah, again they drop fish, um, like the brown rays. As you can see, there is none down here. And yes, I am using the Minecraft texture. But anyway, uh, on to the one well, thing I don't like about survival craft. Are you when you're in what you can't get out? And it, oh. Anyway, next animal is sharks. That must have been the remains of our shark. Just quickly, wrong button. Set it to day again. Now, just ignore that. I'll just put the other one in the chest. I'll just spawn a shark. Uh, it starts off a little, but it should grow soon. Uh, yeah, I'll just fall on the land so you can see it. You can see another really nice model. I think they grow bigger. But again, I'm not entirely sure. Again, they drop fish. Ah, there you go. We've got one in the water. And if I just quickly fly out to the sea, uh, we should be able to find one pretty easily. I say that I'm for the first time ever falling into... Ah, there you go. Lots of them. I'm not sure how big they get, but they get pretty big anyway. So again, you see it drops fish over there. Uh, that was sharks. Next is piranhas. Now, we've got one just there, so it's a good view of it. It's jumped out. And they swim around. I don't think it's born in the sea, but anyway. Piranha spawner egg. Uh, again, they drop fish, like you see over there, but that's not, that's from a shark. Uh, our next animal, moving on, I'm going quite quick, but anyway. Next animal is the wolf. Uh, this is just an average uh, grey wolf, I believe. Yeah, grey wolf. Uh, so, you know, if you hit it, it comes running at you. That's pretty much the only feature. Um, again, moving on. Oh, it turns out if you punch one, I'll join in. Let's run out to sea, because as you can see over there, I don't think you can get back in from the sea. Um, oh, apparently wolves can. Uh, let's grab a machete. There you go, got a machete. Another thing about mobs, they do leave like a dead body, which is quite creepy. But there's been many Minecraft mods that do that, and everyone's like really like them. Anyway, next is the seagull. I'm trying to get out here, but I luckily put that block there, so. You know, quite a cool model. Looks less realistic, more Minecrafty, which I kind of like. 
But, you know, I don't think this will ever overtake Minecraft, so that's fine. Just an average egg, you know, the basic egg, you know, a bit like chickens in Minecraft. Uh, the next one is a duck, uh, my favourite animal. So I'll just grab this egg, uh, spawn one so you can see it. Better, there it is, and off it goes into the water. Uh, and yeah, it's not like you can't spawn mobs in water. You learn something new every video. Uh, I want to keep the machete actually. No. Okay. Uh, apparently, they don't stack. Anyway, uh, just grabbing a spear as well, just in case. So anyway, uh, next is another bird, the final bird, I believe, and this is a raven. So it's basically just a black version of all the other birds. They're all the same model. They've got different skins. Uh, this is the raven egg. Crunch it, not really any uh, special features. But you know, yep. Next one is the wild boar. I really like the model for this, it's really realistic. Uh, you know, you kind of go like hunting, just like throw spears at them. The spears do branch off, which I don't really like, but anyway, um, this is the spawn egg. I think we'll probably have time to look at one more animal and I'll finish the video. Not sure if it's been. It's been. Yeah, not sure. Maybe the next two. I know this is Black Bull. Quite cool, I like the horns on it. Again, let's attack it and it would come running at us if this was the wild. The wild, excuse me. Uh, this is the spawn egg. Uh, next to it. Is the brown bull again? Same model, just a different skin. Um. So yeah, can probably just fit these in. Black cow, pretty much the bull model. So like the horns, they put ears in instead. Uh, this is the spawn egg. Black cow spawner. Brown cow again. Exactly the same, just a different called spawn egg. So yeah, as the sun sets in the world of survival craft, I will end the video here. Uh, part two will be coming soon. So that's the end of the video. Bye guys.